All right, in this video, we're gonna go over the progressive torque control. So on your LCD on the left, you have your assist level and current level, and they are two different things. Your assist level are one through five. Your current will give you a rating between zero and 10 amps. So the bike does much more than 10 amps, but that gives you a better window of where you can really improve your bike range by trying to minimize that zero to 10. Uh, you will go above that when you're climbing or accelerating, but for most riding, you'll be in that zero to 10 range. So if you can drop the current down one or two bars, you'll definitely significantly increase your range. So with progressive torque control, your current will change based on what gear you are using on the right side. So this will change your pedal speed. So gear one will give you the most pedaling speed and that will also give you the most current. If we go to seven, downshift with the button on the front, that will give us slower acceleration with less current. So now we will display that. So I'm in gear one on the right, assist one on the left. So we can see the current went up to about 10 amps on the left. And that was with the fastest pedaling speed on the right. So now I'm gonna shift it down to gear six, let's say. That will do five. Now I'm gonna turn and try it again. So now I'm in gear five on the right. Start pedaling here. Now you can see our current gradually increase up to three bars instead of five bars, so about five amps. Now you can see the current changes from a start. The other uh, big benefit is let's say you're in gear assist five. You do not want a lot of current at once. So you can see right now we're in assist five, but the current is growing slowly while we're in gear five on the right as well. So now if I do a sharp turn and I'm in gear one and I start pedaling, it'll accelerate much faster. So now if I downshift to gear six and I'm going slow, I can do a nice turn without the bike jumping out in front of me. Then if I want more acceleration, downshift, and off we go. I hope that helps, and if you have any other questions, just let us know in the comments.